This video tutorial from Focusrite will show you how to use the loopback feature of your interface. This applies to the Pro24, Pro24 DSP, Pro40 and Liquid Sapphire 56 and allows you to record audio from one program to the other. To set this up, open the program that you wish to record audio from and get your sound file ready. You then need to make sure that this is outputting to the, the Sapphire through the default output of your operating system. In a Mac you can do this by going to System Preferences. On, on Windows you need to go to the Sound Options and Control Panel. However the principle is the same. Once you're on these options you just need to make sure that the output is going to Sapphire. Once this is set up we need to set up the Sapphire Mix Control for loopback recording. Now by default the out sound output of your operating, sy operating system will go to door 1 and door 2 so I'm going to send these channels to the loopback inputs of the unit in order to be recorded. So there we are, we have got door 1 and door 2 set, set as loopback 1 and loopback 2. This allows us to re record in stereo into our door. Once that's set up, we're going to open our door and select the right channel. The loopback inputs come in on the last set of inputs of your audio interface. In this case with the Pro24, that's inputs 15 and 16. When you record loopback, you need to be careful what output is set in your door. If it's set to 1 and 2 as well, then you may create a feedback loop. So it's advisable to set it to 3 and 4 or 5 and 6 um, while you're recording loopback so that it doesn't go back out and feedback round. So now we're ready to record using the loopback. I'm going to open up the audio file, start playing, and then as you can see it's coming into the door. Now we can simply hit record and play, and this will start recording the audio file into your door.